had an issue early on in Tekken 7 where, I would say early on, even like until the end of Tekken 7 where he yeah. just couldn't win the tournament. No, no. In long sets, everybody says, can't, can't touch him. Yeah. But in tournaments, I mean, he always had that kind of mental that mental block, you know. But he managed to get over it and he qualified for the Tekken World Tour Finals. Yeah, he, you know, an exceptional player. And like you said, you know, he's gone to different places to, to train. You know, he went to Pakistan, he went to uh, Korea as well, went to Japan. He, he travels all around the world. And now I feel like he's got a good grasp on like, you know, his play style and he does believe in himself, which is w what he needed. And people were saying beforehand as well, you know, in long sets, like you said, very, very strong in tournament, he wasn't. But now, you know, he's upped his tournament game because tournament's very volatile, right? Yeah. Tournament is like, it's you know, first the two, it's super a quick. Game. It's like a game. It's, it's completely different, different styles. And I think that's where the argument comes. You know, when someone says like, who's the best player in the world? It's like, what do you mean? Like best in first of twos, best in yeah, yeah. First to 100, you know, yeah. di different conversations and everyone has their own opinion on what defines, you know, the best in the world. But Daniel Mado here is definitely up there with, yeah, with the I best. I think that this game uh, has helped him as well with, with, with learning how to play in tournament because yeah. it kind of forces you to play that more aggressive style, right? So, you know, Daniel Mado is already playing just naturally because of the way the game is, yeah. that more tournament style. But yeah, Gurney, let's see what characters are going to be picked. That's number one. Is it going to be the, the Jack or the Nina? I'm expecting the Jack. Jack, yeah. That's the character that I play um, I've, when I've when we played, I always play versus the Jack. But, you know, Jack is also a bit of a different character too. Mm. Uh, the only Jack player, well, one of the only black Jack players, I would say Joe Crush and Joey Fury. Uh, Joey Fury is here. Yeah, he is uh, somewhere. But jo Joe Crush, big shout out to him as well because, they're, you know, they're really showing how to utilize the Gamma House stance. And that is something that, you know, Jack was never really a stance character. No, like no, it was he very wasn't, simple. Yeah. Jab, down back one, forward forward, his timing, it was fundamental. Yeah. But now he's he's got that source, right? Yeah, the um, Gamma House stance as well. Goonie incredible. has always been that simple Jack. Is he going to be yes, able to show us the source oh, though? Goonie would use like four moves and <laughs> yeah. he would win everything. You're standing two, forward forward one, yeah. you know, uh, down forward two. That's all he did. Down back one, that's it. Full crash down back one maybe as well. But not enough. That's, that's all he used to do. It's not but enough. Now one. you can't do that. Yeah. You're forced to play in a different style. And uh, it's going to be good to see if he's going to utilize the, the Gamma House stance, or is he going to play like he did before, you know, patient and just wait for the opportunity to attack. Righto, here we go, guys. It's France versus Italy. Daniel Mardo versus Gunny. I'm glad we're seeing the Jin versus Jack, though. This is, this is sick, you know, both yeah. their main characters. And they're already utilizing the, the <laughs> Gamma House. You know, look at this, pokes, pokes, pokes. Yeah, look, look at this. Good forward forward one into Gamma House. That was, that was a lot of pokes, man. Look at the damage as well. Yeah. yeah. Good. Nice forward one, good duck there. Good break, instant break. Just a down forward two out of nowhere. Oh, oh that <laughs> was so <laughs> sick, oh my god. Yeah, duck in that he smashed, 10 frame, it is a high. And uh, you know, sometimes it can catch you trying to punish, but no, Daniel Mata is definitely ready for that one. Yeah, that was sick. You know, stuff like that will definitely play on your mind. It's like, that That was really sick. You need to be super on point to do that. Yeah. And that's after, you know, Gunny started the round off well and similar to this round he's got the life lead you know he's applying the pressure on but Daniel Mardo has been finding a way back yeah okay good movement there it's good spacing from Daniel Mardo making that down back one whiff Goody back oh, himself to the yeah. wall that's not a good position to be in man yeah, nice forward forward two all the oh plus no. all the blood oh, oh no, my the god oh and he my oh god he ducked at the end he didn't want to eat a fourth one that's what the CBM. Would you have done? Would you have done? I can't do anything. That's yeah, the CBM yeah. right there, man. He, he was telling me as well. He's like, man, I can just do that. It's a chip damage, chip damage. That's and what CBM was saying. Yeah, yeah remember, because, because at the wall, it does the little wall crump, right? So you have, you can't do anything. You're like plus yeah. infinity. Uh, plus you infinity. Yeah, yeah, you've yeah, got to just guess. <laughs> that was, that is mad, bro. That was actually crazy. Okay. Hey, he's probably going to do it again, and it's going to play on Gunny's mouth. Oh, nice the whiff punish. punish. Yo, Yo, these gin players have been doing good today, man. You know, book first, and now Daniel Mardo. Daniel Mar I mean, these are two of the best gins in the world, man. And we've got Rife as well. We haven't seen him on stream and yet, but that guy's going to probably be doing the same stuff. That's crazy, man. Right now, Daniel Mardo looking very, very strong. Good. He's starting the rounds off really, really solidly, but, you know, Daniel Mardo, like you said, bringing it back. Yeah, he's playing really good. Uh, yeah. it's, it's impressive to see his style change because before, you know, he wasn't that, he wasn't that player that was good at, at tournament. Yeah. But now it looks like he's super ready. He understands, you know, how fast-paced first of two is and yeah. how you have to start, you know, you have to start playing instantly, right? With with um, first two, you know, tens, you can just slow down a bit and you can you know, analyze your opponent here. You have to think at 100 miles per hour. You do. You, ha you definitely have to, man. Right now, the crowd is a little bit quiet because... Oh, yeah, because yeah. the they're, someone's not, they're not someone's in the Euros <laughs> finals tomorrow. The Juni's down one game. It's not looking good for the big man thing. Yeah. It's okay, though, but Daniel Mardo, though, he's up a game. Again, a good start. Daniel Mardo, pressure. Oh, nice. Trade on the fourth for two. See, and that's what I'm used to going to be doing. Just two, two, two one, one yeah. two, two, one, back dash, down, back one. But he has to change his style here. Yeah, I don't think this is, this is This is the, this is the old going to be like. Yeah. 
No gamma house sounds like, right? It's definitely gonna take some um, some adaptation, but, but look at that. Yeah. Maybe you can make it work. I think in the long run it won't work, right? Like in the long run, if you carry on playing like this, you need to use all of Jack's wow. tools. Was that even a combo? I don't know if that was a combo. <laughs> that was crazy. That gets the round. Uh, Goody. Okay. Yeah. Forward, forward one. It's a guaranteed damage. Yeah. Down forward two again, man. He's really just trying to catch Danny Mardo, making a hard read on the duck. Okay. Come on. Gunny, Gamma House stance now. Come on, Gunny. Oh, he jumps back. Nice, just does it. Wild Thunder 2 4. Right, just trying to control. Oh my god, he's just, just out, out of range. You can see that Danny Mardo is so ready, though, Rukan. He's, he's so looking ready for, for it. He's looking for all of these things. You know, any small whiff by Gunny is going to get punished. Okay, no break on the tidal wave. Rage available now. Heat available. Down two, no block. Into Goes the down back legs. four. Yeah. Didn't even use the heat. I know, Rukan, you don't like that, man. You're no, looking up. No. You're upset, I'm man. always upset when they yeah, don't use yeah. the heat, man. I'm ready to use my heat round. Remember, round one, fight, bam. <laughs> heat yeah. instantly, bro. Man. That's why I lose, man. So. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> back one, two. Oh, man, wow. He tried to yeah. use the gun help, but yeah, not going to work out for him. Daniel Mardo in the driver's seat at the moment. Still has heat to use as well if he wants to. Just doing forward board one on its own there. There you go. Very nice heat engager there. Oh, back God. two. The pressure back against the wall. Yep. He's taking advantage of this. Hang on, hang on. Gunny. Oh, good back dash from Danny Mardo. He still has he had so much heat. Mm. He could have done some other stuff there, but either way, he takes it. Yep, down forward one there. Caught Danny Mardo ducking. Nice oh. sidewalk left. That is the way you want to go. It's kind of the way you've always wanted to go versus Jack, you know, if you want to sidestep against him. Yeah, good side sidestep. Left. Right, what's the mix up here? Oh, again, oh, here we go. Oh, no. no. Please. Look at the grey health as well. There's so much pressure, man. It's insane. What the hell can he even get out of this? Look, he's uh, really tough here. Daniel Mardo is controlling the game. One pixel remaining. And that's it. Yeah, yeah, set point now for Daniel Mardo. I would like to see G uh, and Guni go for that one throw more. You know, it does switch sides. It switches positions on hit and on, um, yeah. on break. Yeah, what I want to see as well, Gunny go for more what Gamma House stance there, but Daniel Mardo is just not letting him breathe, goes for the low there. And that is typically what you want to do versus the bigger characters. You just want to, you want to stay in their face because they haven't really got the movement. Good break on that one plus two throw as well. I'm so impressed with everyone's throw breaking. Everyone's breaking grabs really, really well today. Back against the wall. Yep, so I said two, plus frames. Okay. Forward one, just on its own, nice. gets it with a down forward two. Go, give us a good combo here. Gunny, oh, no! no! That was a big drop on the combo, an opportunity dropped. Yeah, I reckon Daniel Mardo's going to take this, though. Hang on a He's minute. definitely going to take advantage of that drop. Combo. Oh, oh he tried, oh, to, oh, do oh, it. He oh, tried oh. to do the same thing as before. He tried to duck and launch, and it wow. didn't work. He wasn't fast enough there. And look at that. Even he's stressed. He's like, look. Yeah. Hey. I, I don't think I've seen that before. The trade on the on the heat smash, yeah. the, on the second part of it, into a full combo. So, yeah, Gunny somehow, you know, the fundamentals showing out there. Exactly, and he was able, yeah. to, able to take that game. Um, and, 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 you know, weather the storm of that defense. He uh, did, that, he did, that yeah. Because yeah. it seemed like Daniel Mardo was always on the front foot. Like, he's always the one putting pressure, always the one, you know, doing insane whiff punishes. But G, just a few good reads, yeah. and he's and he's back in the game. He's back in the game indeed. Here we go. Daniel Mardo now is going to have to think hard. Oh, that was definitely a miss. We'll take it, though. Oh, oh, this, oh, oh drops the combo, uh, though. Brother, uh. <laughs> you can't be dropping those combos, man. What was that? Okay. All right. Again, just playing safe here. I, again, doesn't need to do much here, though. This is the right time to play, like, you know, Tekken 7 Goonie. Like, yeah. Just 2-1. Just go for the hell sweep. Oh, oh big whiff, no punish. You just out of range. Forward, forward, two. Gonna get the heat engager. Use more the pressure. heat dash. Go oh, for the long. Nice. Yeah, good, good decision making by, by Daniel Mardo there. Use the heat dash. More pressure just to, you know, suffocate. Mm. Goonie there. Nice one standing for punish. Hey. Yep. All right, tombstone. Good stuff. Oh, that was. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. They they've nerfed the, the, the debug yeah, now. Yeah, it's so it's much super slower. Slow, super yeah. reactable now. Because of that, he's gonna lose all this damage and be in a bad position as well. Yep. Wow. And look at he, this. <laughs> that, that time he just. <laughs> <laughs> that's what and that's what happens when you duck in it. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Good interrupt the last four. He still has heat available, man. What are you gonna do, Gunny? Gunny needs to activate. Use your resources. Fort Fort 1, he's looking for the right time to do it here. Yeah, he wants to bait something out of Daniel. Oh, no big whip on the on the Fort Fort 2, but no punish again. Jesus Christ, 20 seconds remaining here. Goes for the grab, good throw break. Oh my god. Time's gonna be a factor here very soon. Activates heat. You've got so much resources now. Yeah. Might as well just throw it out. Nice, oh. man.
That was a good option from Daniel Mada after blocking the heat burst, going for down four because it it would have gone underneath the heat smash. But look at that hop kick to start the round. Daniel Mado just too good right now. Yeah, really confident hop kick there. Established dominance. Started off very well in this round. Yeah, fighting back though. Tries to use electric to get out. Whoa, okay. We've got some down the house stuff now. Plus frames of running yeah, off this, this is where Jack wants to be, you know. Having your opponent back against the wall, you can do so much stuff. You know how dangerous he is. Grabs. Okay. Now plus frames. Now, now, now we're everything. Oh, what the hell was that? Just pressing. Now we're playing second. There we go. Exactly. G on the back foot. He knows he's one round away from losing this. Has a round on the board though. Bro, that was so good. It seemed like when Daniel Marlow's back is against the wall, you know, it's GG's. You know, he has all the options there. Mm. And he works really well. G, super good to stay in this. Chipping away, chipping away, chipping away. Nice oh. sidestep into the hockey though. Has a breakable wall right there. Oh, Down goes two. to the low. Legs, Multi legs. Yeah, multiple lows. Good interrupt. Good punish there with the wall standing four. Yeah, both guys defense on point at the moment. Two jab beats the electric. Oh my god, both still have heat as well. Smack 30 seconds already gone here. Forward, forward two. Uh oh. Legs again. Oh no, that's the wrong punish. Oh, blocks that. That was really good. Forward, forward two again. Oh, the interrupt after forward, forward one into the Gamma House stance. Oh. Man, that was super.